Hello guys, in this video I would like to talk about the geometric shape of square deck that how to find the new height and width of a square deck after changing its shape to a different geometric or how to change the shape of an old square deck to a new different geometric shape by increasing or decreasing the height and width of a square deck for example there is a fluid of 3400 cfm flowing at friction loss of uh, point one inch of water column through a square deck which is an area of uh, 20 inches by 20 inches so let's say for some reasons or we have no enough space for the height of our deck and we want the height of this deck uh, which is 20 inches long to be reduced to 15 inches and we still want the same amount of uh, airflow which is uh, 3400 CFM to be delivered through 400 square inches of uh, deck work after reduction in the height of our deck so this is something uh, we can also easily do it by connecting a transition between the deck and the wall which will allow us to change the height but the purpose is not connecting uh, transition so the purpose is to find the width of the new ship deck after changing its height as you can see in the example the height of deck the exceeded the height of the wall so we want it to not to exceed the height of this wall for example the deck ship we want to change its height and had it over its width is uh, 20 inches by 20 inches uh, which is uh, equivalent to 400 square inches so we want the 3400 CFM to flow through 400 square inches of uh, new deck shape so what will be the weight of the new deck if we increase the height of whole deck to 15 inches uh, first of all we'll need to determine how many square inches of deck we want to add or remove from the existing shape uh, for example we have an existing a deck of uh, 20 by 20 inches if you remove uh, 5 inches from the height so 5 times 20 equals 100 square inches uh, will be removed so to find the height of the new shape of deck uh, we'll use this uh, formula the weight of new ship deck uh, equals to the area of old deck uh, removed part divided by the height of whole deck left part plus the weight of old deck uh, left part that will give us the new so 20 inches uh, times 5 inches uh, divided by 15 inches plus 20 inches uh, equals uh, 26.666 inches so as you can see we've just decreased the height of our old ship deck that was 20 inches to 15 inches and had it over its width and change its shape which was square to rectangular shape by decreasing the height and increasing the width so here's one more example in this example we're going to change the shape of this deck by decreasing its uh, width and add it in the height so to find the height and new geometric uh, shape of uh, this deck we'll use a different uh, formula the height of uh, new shape deck equals to the area of old deck removed part 
divided by the width of wall deck, the lift part plus uh, the height of wall deck, uh, lift part that will give us the new height for our deck. For example, we have a rectangle deck of 15 inches by 30 inches. So if we remove a 10 inches from the width of our existing deck, so 10 inches times 15 inches, that means 150 square inches will be removed. So that leaves uh, 15 times 20 inches, which is equals to 300 square inches. So 15 times uh, 10 inches divided by 20 inches plus 15 inches equals 22.5 inches. So that's the new height for our new shape. In the first example, to find the new shape of our deck, we divided the area of old deck at remove part by the height of whole deck at lift part then plus width of whole deck lift part we got the new width of our deck. In the second example, we divided the area of old deck at remove part divided by the height of whole deck lift part then plus the width of old deck at lift part we got the new height for our deck and its shape was changed. So that's it for this video. I appreciate you for 